Welcome to Surviving 100 Days in Kaiju Universe. In this game, every 10 minutes a day passes, so surviving 100 days is gonna be tough. Today, the Ghidorah family has been chosen, first surviving as the little weakest one, then this one, and then ending on Monster Zero. Every time I join a server, everyone just tries to find me and hunt me, which makes these 10 times harder, but way funner. Okay, day one surviving in Kaiju Universe. Already I'm pretty scared. The entire chat knows I'm here. They knew I was here like the second I joined the server. It looks like some of them are noble followers of the Riot Monkey though. The other ones seem to want to kill me. I sent out a message to the server to let them know I mean business. I was immediately met by conflict in the chat. It's only day one. God, it's like a horrifying thing to come into. This is Tokyo right now. Oh my God, everyone's trying to challenge me. It will be hard to survive here, but we are an epic individual who survives in the worst of areas, so it shan't be too difficult. Yes, the mecha hails me. That's what I'm talking about right there, baby. We have a soldier on our side in case the server gets bananas. Day one was going smooth as baby crap. Everyone was on our side for the most part. The server was not going to destroy me. But of course, it always starts out like this. All right, things were getting a little sketchy. I was now surrounded by Kaiju. I have 4,000 health and a good amount of speed. If things get poopy, I'm gonna bounce right on out of here. Whoa, things are getting poopy. Oh God, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yep, I saw that coming a mile away. Look at that. <laughs> kaiju, unfortunately, are Kaiju, meaning they are monsters. Dropping off other hints throughout the game as to my location. I don't know how that's gonna help them find me, but I hope it helps. I decided to end day one by just watching these goobers split up and look for me as I just kind of perched looking at them do it. Look at this thing's dead little eyes, bro. It looks like a freaking shark when their eyes roll back as they're starting to attack you. That's, that's exactly what it looks like. This dude's actually a pretty good looking model. Not gonna lie, like the way it's designed, like it, they, the, the heads look at each other, you know? Your face! Ah, ah, ah. I'm sorry, little guy. You... <laughs> I'm sorry. You know what? We don't have to just peacefully exist. We can kill people also. That is an option. Wow, that did so much damage right there. He's at freaking half health. This thing's incredible. He jump scared. <laughs> Blue lobster smooches men. Oh man, how are you gonna recover? <laughs> they too started out pretty well. I had this lobster drive me to town. I fell off it, but it, it happened. I found this nice isolated spot on the map. I definitely wasn't a hiding from everyone. This is just my private beach. This guy's talking to me right now and he doesn't even know that I'm hiding right behind him. Okay, it was time to re-enter Tokyo. I was gonna sneak in from the back underwater so they didn't see me flying in. If you just sneak in, then it's natural. See, they're gonna be looking for a guy that's hiding. So if you sit right out in the open, they'll never suspect it's you. I'm a freaking genius. Hiding in plain sights. Oh crap, that guy's coming right for me. Oh God. Oh, oh God. Oh God. Man, there's, what, what kind of? What kind of thing is that to say to another human? By the next day, things are going pretty smooth. I had actually taken over Tokyo. It was a rare situation where nobody was hunting me yet. It was pretty amazing. I put a death sentence on that ape down there and he's just been slain. It's pretty great. We have like a freaking Coliseum thing going on. I put another death sentence on the other monkey where I shall sit up in my podium and watch as he's taken from us. Oh God, things were going beautifully. Even when I went to extremely hostile war zones, everyone was just like preoccupied killing each other. Nobody targets this Ghidorah. Look how chaotically beautiful this war zone is. Godzilla's killing Zillas, Mecha's killing Godzilla's, Mothra's killing Rodan's. It's literally, there's a freaking Argo here. Oh no, that's a Muta. <laughs> oh my God, they found me again. How do they always find me? I'm in like the mist. <laughs> how, how, how do you even do that? It gets progressively weirder. Like, what the hell? Why are you allowed to even say that in Roblox? Come on. Okay, after more feet talk than I could possibly wish on my worst enemies, it's time for the next Ghidorah. So for this one, I was thinking we'd go 5,000 health, max damage, then the rest of the movement speed. We want a lot of speed so we could vanish when we got her to stay alive, but we also, I feel like 5,000 health is a good amount, but there's no point in having a lot of health if we can't escape our enemies, though. So I suppose I'll do this. It's staying alive, so we gotta stay alive. And here we are. This one's much bigger than the other, much smaller than Monster Zero still. It's freaking slow as crap. It's slow enough to get beamed as soon as I spawn in. No, the other one was so untouchable and beautiful. I'm already being beamed by so many people. This is the 
cost of being big. With the bigger you are, the more people beam you. Just a giant XP bag flying over the water. But now it is time to piss on him. Oh, I'm gonna have the freaking beef coming my way after this one. Oh, that Godzilla hates me, dude. I don't know. I don't know why I stuck around to beam him more. Two can play that game, you fart tickler. Okay, now we really need to vanish. If I get beamed again, I'm gonna slow down, and that's gonna be atrocious for staying alive. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's a fly in my face. Get out of here, Rodan. I don't want whatever you're selling, little guy. Shoo! Be gone, beast. I will strike you down into oblivion. Okay, I lost everybody, and I'm back here chilling. And now I kind of want to find that Godzilla and kill him. If I can kill him, that'd be so awesome. And better yet, it would make him so angry. Aw, oh, crap. Someone's got a Vuthan out. If that Vuthan tries to kill me, that's it. I think it could outfly me, catch me in any... It could kill me easy. Oh, God, he's a fan. Wait, wait, he's a fan. He's a fan. Wait, wait, I'm right. <laughs> Hang on there, little buddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I got to plead for my life right now. Easy, little man. It's the only way we're... Oh, wait, he's a low level, though. I get... I maybe could have killed him. I don't know. Voodoo's so amazing when he's good. We were able to survive this run-in, but only by taking a photo with the man who was trying to kill me. It's not a very proud way to survive, but it's a way to survive. Just smile and wave, boys. Smile and wave. <laughs> it's how we're gonna survive this. People are trying to 1v1 me, but I'm explaining that I, I have to survive like 20 days. I can't, I can't risk a 1v1. There's so much risk. Oh God, destroyer wants me. No, of all things for you to select, it's, I'm just such a big, slow-moving bird. I'm so good for experience points. He barely damaged me, though. Wow, what a lame beam. I thought I would just make soup. This turkey felt nice enough to distract people. I don't know why. I think I have really bad ADD. Unfortunately, when I said making soup, people started figuring out exactly what that meant. I had overstayed my welcome at the volcano. That turkey sounds like it's getting dangerously close. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. This turkey is ridiculous. This turkey wants the beef. Oh, I'm the best at turkey dodging on the planet. Professional turkey dodger. Oh, crap. Okay, I died once. I did. I got jumped by six guys. It was ridiculous. I almost don't... It, it almost doesn't even count. Okay, <laughs> there, was, there was a mob hunting me. We do have to restart, but I'm just restarting as this one. I'm not going back to the other one because that would just be insane. The new day one was looking pretty cool though. I found these Ghidorahs just hanging out. I found a group of Ghidorah fellas. Thought I'd say hello to them. What's going on, gentlemen? Just a couple of Ghidorahs hanging out behind the walls. I get it. Just a couple of spaghetti noodles having a sword fight. Makes sense to me, man. Are you real? Nuh-uh. I'm not, I'm not doing this again. <laughs> I'm not Riot. No one think I'm Riot. I don't want to be hunted mercilessly anymore. It's too difficult. Okay, someone's got some big nuts around here, huh? It's always a junior. A junior or a 1954. He's coming right at me. You know what's scary is that I, those juniors are actually freaking, like, powerful. They're beefy little fellas. But we do have a kick. We have a mighty kick. We should be able to kick them over. Oh, he's actually might win this. We might not have the best melee. Hang on. Are we even hitting him? This is risky. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I lost stuff being wrist right now. Don't fly too high. He'll beam you. <laughs> I gotta watch out for this little guy right now. Juniors, oh, they're, they're strong, dude. Anyone who thinks juniors aren't strong has never maxed their juniors. Simple as that. Healed up. It's time to kill something. It's not enough to just survive. We also have to be a menace. Okay, that's a burning Godzilla. That'll destroy me. A Scylla. Now this looks like something I can bully. Dude, it's crazy how long the moves take to recharge after you use a beam with this thing. Like, it's not a powerful creature. I hate you, Godzilla. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you so much, bro. You could have shot at both of us, but you shoot at me. That's the cost of being... Now this guy's shooting at me. Oh, God. <laughs> Just stop attacking me and he gets beamed by everybody. These people are evil. Poor little guy's asking for help. I had help, but they'd get me too. Surviving like this is just plain easy. You can just abuse these things. It won't even matter. I'll kick these things in the face. No, two of them is actually pretty strong. <laughs> Whoa, look how trippy they all look at their own different glow up colors in the mist. In the red mist, all glowy and blue and red and stuff. I sure hope this guy's not about to shoot me. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> no, 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 no. Ultimate Beam is crazy strong. Hang on. I don't have a whole lot of health left. Okay, looks like we're hanging out in the slums for a bit. Down here in the dumps. 
How's it feel, dirtbag? Ah, 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 ah. We got these long heads that we can just kind of peek over the mountainside. Oh, God, it can beam us right back. Hang on. Look at him retreating from his mighty cliff. Cowardice creature. Jump off. That's what I thought. <laughs> This Ghidorah is actually pretty stinking good if you use it like an absolute chicken, then it's amazing. He's actually almost dead down there. Oh God, bet you wish you could get me with that beam right now, don't you? Bet you really wish you could. He's actually getting me a little bit. Better run for the water, little man. <laughs> oh no, he got finished off by that guy. <laughs> that sucks. Things are going so smoothly, I feel safe enough to go take a dump right now and just leave my kaiju unattended to. Okay, after hiding for a little over an hour because I had to eat, I ate the biggest, most delicious pile of ground beef ever. Trying to get buff, so I'm on the beef and freaking chocolate milk diet. It's disgusting, but I'm well fed. A bunch of days passed while I was eating too, which I don't know, it might be cheating, but like I gotta eat for God's sakes. You know how long it takes for 100 days to pass? It's like literally a full day. It's like 10 hours, it's crazy. I also took a dump that may or may not have taken a long time. Surviving as Monster Zero is one of the most fantastic things ever, dude. Nobody messes with these things. They're a complete top of the food chain. Except like Nuclears, Destroyers, Godzillas, Juniors, 1954s, Rodans, Mechagodzillas, Ultimas, basically anything. Everything messes with this guy. Let's go say hi to these people. Hola, fellers. What's going on down here? Bunch of shrimps and Godzillas. That's nice. Three-headed freak! He's still down there talking crap. Look at him. See that speech bubble? That was him talking crap right there. Feel my wrath, little man. How dare you insult my amazing heads. Now die as you flee. Flee and burn. I don't even see him in there. There's so much electricity. And you, you filthy little rat. You are so lucky I accidentally alpha roared and Gurus. Why is the alpha roar even one of the numbers? I guess because it has some effects. But it shouldn't be one of the numbers. Look at these Godzillas over here. Let's land and kill them because it's funny. And that's what you do as a Monster Zero. I land right on top of them. Even better. Oh, they just made friends with... I'm <laughs> this guy's trying to escape me, but I'm stuck on top of him. <laughs> that, that sucks, dude. That sucks a lot. That's so funny. Hang on, whoa, whoa, whoa. I just discovered my new favorite thing to do in this game. Hang on. It's harder to land on the non-Titanuses. Oh, you're making it real easy for me to spot you, though. All right, land. No. I'm, getting, I'm letting myself get hurt so much right now. Ah, ha, ha. Now I've got you. <laughs> you can't escape me. <laughs> oh, no, stupid freaking game mechanics. Now this poor little fish is going to get zapped. Darn, that would have been so epic if that worked out, though. You know what I'm saying? Oh, crap. I should not be concentrating. This close to a Hollow Earth breath. Oh, God. The server's recognizing me more and more. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, crap. I shouldn't be doing this right here. I don't have enough health to survive this. No one get closer. You'll get electrocuted. Oh, my God. Oh, and then he nukes right. I'm so happy I got out of there right before the nuke. Oh, my God. <laughs> that would have sucked. Come on, buddy, come get a screenshot so I don't have to worry about you slaughtering me. This is often what women do with men, I feel like. Like, sure, I'll give you my phone number so you don't follow me home and eat me. Use this opportunity to charge up my electricity because you never know when you're gonna need it. Okay, it's perfectly above, it's nice. Where are you? No! Ah! Oh God, I landed in front of the floral beam. <laughs> Destroy it, you monster. Uh-oh. There's a good amount of damage that I got. This guy's got to die. Oh, he got, he got teamed on, which is super messed up. But like, what do you, what am I supposed to do about that? Like, I just met this guy. I didn't tell him to team for me. You know what I'm saying? That was more just like an indirect action. Oh my God, I just checked. I'm actually on the last day, which makes sense because the sun went down like half an hour ago, like in real life. So there's no way we're not pushing the last days. We shall finish this by landing on these guys and ruining their day because that's just funny to me. Hang on. Mistakes may have been made. No, no, no. The ruinous thunder is just too great. Everything will have to escape my rage. Although now they're gonna kill me. Actually, since this is the last day, there's no reason to wait till tomorrow. We could go ahead and end this here. This challenge was tougher than before. I freaking died once, dude. I died once as one of the guitars. It was way harder than before. I've learned a little something something about survival around these parts. Turkey Rodans are turds. That's what I've learned. This has been a freaking awesome challenge, though. I had a lot of fun struggling for 10 hours. If you guys want to see more stuff, comment more challenges down below. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>